Hello YouTube. What's going on? Just wanted to give a uh, four year review on the BX25D. Uh, let you guys know what I thought about it. How it's done over the four years. Uh, and the things I don't like about it. Uh, all in all the tractor has been uh, wonderful. I'd rate it a 9.5 out of 10. Uh, there's a couple of things that I have not liked about it and one and the biggest issue that I've had is the actual loader capacity which as you can see that's a two LA 240 and Kubota if you want to know how much Kubota loaders are rated at that's kilogram so you take that and you times it by 2.2 and that will give you your loader rating which uh, puts this loader at just under 600 pounds around 570 or somewhere in there uh, and then you add the weight of the bucket uh, and it's it will it will lift the bucket full I mean there everything you put in the bucket it will lift but uh, I had set a pallet forks and that's where I would run into my issue uh, I needed to lift several things and the, and the uh, the tractor just wasn't able to lift what I needed it to uh, to lift and that's been one of the biggest weaknesses but as far as the bucket uh, lifting dirt gravel all that stuff tractor did wonderful tractor did exactly what it was designed to do no issues mechanically uh, engine crank every time backhoe worked wonderful no issues whatsoever with the backhoe uh, dug uh, several trenches for me dug out around the foundation for me uh, dug up several stumps for me uh, just no never an issue with the backhoe um, the uh, mower deck great uh, cut I mean it's just a solid solid cut machine um, the uh, other weakness is that little uh, transmission plastic fan I never heard it I never had any issue with it I know others did but uh, you think they would have protected that a little bit better underneath the tractor um, I just uh, it's kind of exposed under there for for limbs and stuff and basically that's the only two things well not one other when it comes time to change the oil uh, it's not quite as easy as you would think because you to get to everything you've got to remove your your bumper guard or your bumper there uh, it's got to be removed then you can remove your your side uh, cowans and get to the uh, oil filter and all the things you need uh, but uh, that's it everything else the tractor's been wonderful uh, strong solid um, have no complaints uh, but uh, I do need more lift capacity got to have more lift capacity uh, for what I'm trying to use the tractor for so although this is a four-year review it's also time to say goodbye to the, the BX and after today it's it's going uh, we got a wonderful trade-in allowance for it and we are uh, moving up uh, probably moving up higher than what I initially had planned for but uh, it's just how, how everything worked out got a little bit more tractor than I'd initially thought so but uh, you'll see that in the next video but I did want to show this the last time and anybody that is considering a BX uh, it's a wonderful tractor and I believe the new ones have got almost 200 more pounds of lift capacity on the BX uh, 23S so I, that, that would make a big it would make a big difference another extra 200 pounds so uh, but uh, yeah wonderful tractor 
thank y'all for uh, watching and uh, hopefully y'all can uh, be seeing the next one here on the next video. Uh, thank you.